when is it? Hey. Stella Apolot is my name. I work for Green World International Uganda. Uh, our regional office is basically in Soroti, the region. Um, the reason why I am in Kitkum today, actually since the beginning of this trade show, I've brought good news to the farmers. Um, Green World as a package, as a promotion for farmers. Green World One supports farmers with the organic fertilizers, and these are good fertilizers without chemicals in it. These are pure original fertilizers for farmers. I mean to say they are good for spraying all types of crops. For example, maize, uh, peanuts, uh, beans, all, any category of, um, of crops, uh, this organic fertilizer is a good one. And if you want, uh, for example, farmers, many farmers today are struggling. You plant seeds, but you don't see the goodness of planting. You don't see the goodness of the work of your hands. Why? Our soil, it might be soil, and maybe you bought a, a, a wrong seed, but if you use these organic fertilizers, it helps you to harvest more and more, and it helps you to bring good yields. So that is the reason why I've come all the way from Soroti, uh, to Kit Boom, I've brought good news. But uh, we have our head office in Kampala, uh, that is in Nakasero, so it's house. Thank you. I'm Charles Basilio, a uh, few people made the hub, uh, make it lunch. So one of you know what it is, so okay, in it. I was down when game, we a chara kilo food. We for a farm in 2022 season. Eh? Uh, <laughs> Uh, my part is in the but you can my papa, my banner. But you can mark soya, but you can get number 16 uh, uh, beans. Oh, the jar will be a pain banner. You don't have a season in any, uh, what time on it? When you have a food, you can get a pay on the quarter of your enemy. You can get a pay on the junk of my kid room, but you can get a pay on the kid room, but you can get a pay on the town. Present you, The veteran is the of Kitkum Business Promoters and Exhibitors Cooperative Society Trade Exhibition 2020. Uh, this year exhibition, our theme is restoration of hope to farmers through smart agribusiness. We have come up with this exhibition theme because we wanted to promote farmers and to make them have from what has happened for the last 20 years, you know, this corona of 2019 affected most of the activities. And because of being the core of our income from northern part of Uganda and more especially actually, we feel it wise to educate our farmers and to make them pick up modern ways of farming. 
like if you see now in the soft brown, we have agro input dealers, those who sell seeds. With us here, we have uh, Hub International. They provide trainings to farmers for free. They sell seeds, improve seeds. We have Equator Seeds also. They're also dealing in with farmers selling seeds, training them in post office handling, in preparation of land, and how to maintain crops to give a good yield. With us here also, we have Green World International. They're also doing the same. So we still expect more to come from Gulu. They're coming. Uh, more exhibitors are not seen here, but we, because there's exhibition in Lira and Soroti. So the exhibitors of Lira and Soroti that are joining us here on tomorrow, Tuesday. With the exhibition, you will not go away from the laser and entertainment. And that is why when you... about uh, the local exhibitors. When we started a trade exhibition in Kitgu, most of the exhibitors were people coming from outside. The local people were not like embracing what we have brought. But right now, as I talk, almost 50% of the exhibitors are the move away from selling diesel liquor uh, and uh, selling foods to come and exhibit on something that can promote our team as for the BLM because our objectives is not about entertainment. Our objectives is to ensure that the business community within Kitgu, they improve from their all the type of business sectors that they have. is that for this year we have decided to give free space to farmers because we really want them to come and participate. Education to farmers. My last words to them is, in whatever we are doing, we are doing for the betterment of farmers, not for our own benefit, because we want to change the way of doing business, taking agri-business agri in a serious way.